Hello everyone and welcome to our channel, About Morocco. If you are new visitors, we invite you to subscribe to help us develop the content of our channel. Today's video pays tribute to the talented first aviator of the Arab world Turiya Chewi, and to all the women who carry in them the future. Discover with us this inspiring story, and keep in mind that you may be close to your goal, so persevere and never give up your dreams. Courageous, tenacious, and determined, Turiya Chewi built her own career during the 1950s, in a world previously reserved for men, aviation. Since then, she has become a role model for all the women in the Arab world who have taken the step by becoming pilots. Born on December 14, 1936, the pilot was the eldest daughter of Abdelwad and Zina Chewi. A French-speaking journalist and director, he was committed to the resistance against the protectorate. Thus he ensured the instruction of his daughter by pushing her to emancipate herself. In particular, he passed on to her all his love for cinema and theater, so much so that he staged it several times during his artistic tours. From his childhood, Turiya played small roles and made a few appearances with his father in one of the films in which he starred. Indeed, Abdelwad Chewi had a role in a film by French director André Zwababa. Moving to Casablanca, marked a turning point in the girl's life. The Chewi family moved from Fez to the White City in 1948. On the spot, Turiya and her younger brother, Salahedin, rubbed shoulders with the great names of Moroccan nationalism, including Elal El Fassi and Ahmed Balafre, Zemaine magazine recalled in 2012, explaining their father's strong ties to Istiklal. It was at the heart of these meetings, both militant and intellectual, that Turiya Chewi forged a free and emancipated spirit, becoming early autonomous. As a child, she dreamed of taking to the air, of being a pilot. His father was by his side and encouraged her to carry out his projects. After long efforts, she finally enrolled her in the school of Tid Melil, until then reserved for the French, Zemaine recalled. After that, she graduated in 1951 and made headlines in the Moroccan and international press. At the age of 15, Turiya Chewi became the first female pilot in the Arab world. She was also the first Moroccan civilian pilot, men and women alike, Zemaine said. The girl prodigy became a national pride. By stowing her notoriety in a world still very masculine, Turiya Chewi also became the voice of the cause of women. Thus, Zemaine recalled that the pilot was ambassador of the women's cause within the Lala Amina institution, named after the youngest daughter of Mohammed Ben Youssef born in exile in Madagascar, dedicated to helping young girls and defending women's emancipation. As quickly as she realized her childhood dreams, Turiya Chewi left this world very early. Halfway to true historical glory that she wrote daily in the feminine and at the very beginning of a promising career, the young pilot was murdered before she could fulfill the ambitions she had for the women of her country. On March 1, 1956, on the eve of the signing of the Independence Treaty, Turiya Chewi was murdered at point-blank range at the edge of the car where she was sitting next to her brother. Turiya's funeral procession was attended by 60,000 mourners who loved her and appreciated her efforts and achievements, which contributed to the advancement of Moroccan women until she reached the world. So finally, to all of you, start today creating a vision for yourself, your life, and your career. Bounce back from adversity and create what you want, rebuild, and rebrand. Tell yourself it's possible along the way, have patience, and maintain peace with yourself during the process. And remember that if you never try, you'll never know. You are what you manifest. So dear viewers, if you like the video, let's be friends and subscribe.